Hello? Am I live? Yeah. Anyone around? I don't know. Gotta get the game. Hello, Kovar. Okay, there we go. I'm back. I was away for a while. But I'm back. Oh, that is loud. On my end, at least. Okay, so let, let's see here. Sound effects still good. Like, we're still getting them, right? Anyway, welcome to Dustin has a sick. I have got- I have come down with the sickness, so I may sound a little weird. Don't worry, I'm sure that'll subside soon enough. My webcam looks like a little too high up. I don't know. Anyway, last time we got the Sky World, I think. Semi-final. Semi-final world, I think. Okay, so I I guess just do this for shrooms in the snow. Oh, and it's an auto scroll. Oh, and it's a bounce. Big old ninja. Not very stealthy. Now give me that. No, no. Oh, but there's stuff down here. Oh! <laughs> and I slipped off the ledge. Which is a good start. Hammer. Okay, good, good aim. I like to pride myself on that. I'm really good at aiming. No, 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 no. No, don't put... I see that. I see your slightly different tiles. Oh. No, don't don't poke me. Don't touch. Do not touch. They just ru What do you mean? Oh, I need the fire flower. I need the fire flower. Okay, so where can I where can I get one of those? Probably in the first world. I have one life left, and that's not- that's not good. <laughs> that's not good. I mean, I lose all my points and lives that I had last time. Just like a real Mario game. It's like I'm- it's like I'm really there. 
I don't know why I have my, like, leg <laughs> crossed on my lap. Oh no, I unplugged it. No, give me my controller back. There we go. Mm, good connector. Good connector. Okay, here. Can I? May I? Can you? Should you with a fish? Really must you? It's delish. Okay, that's a hammer. I don't need that. Okay, my mercy invincibility also prevents me from picking up items for some reason. Okay, there we go. Now, can, can you exit and keep the item? I forgot. Yes, you can. Good. That will save me some time. <laughs> Probably not a lot. The level's just like 10 seconds long, but it... You know, that's 10 seconds I could spend painting a picture of a guy with a big knife. So I at least got that going for me. The squirreled. Okay, let's try that again. Got no freaking lives. I hope I don't die. Just get them like that, it's fine. There we go. And now, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, get me in there. Get me in there. Oh, I got, I got some eye stuff going on. What is the sound effect that's playing? Okay, but that, that, that's the coin. Do I get points for destroying these? I do. So it's in my best interest to destroy as many of them as physically possible. Plate shatter dot wave. It don't die. If if at all that you can help it, do not die. Uh, do not get shot with a bullet either. I, I thought that went without saying, but maybe it doesn't. <laughs> Dissolve the Tetris. Grab the coin, you know, eventually. And there we go, that's the end. Hello, Isaac. Okay, now where where's the mini game? I already forgot. How do I go up? Oh, I do this. It's that easy. Okay, that's the secret. That's the place from Wario Land 4. Oh, right, 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 the floating door. I, th I think, right? Yeah, okay. I wish Langton were here so I could tell him I'm eating Captain Crunch. Yeah, I think he made a early bedtime. And by early, I mean... Perfectly normal time to go to bed. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh god, please.
I, I remember I, I don't think I did very good on this last time. What? Y'all saw that, right? Y'all saw how, how gypped I was right there out of that? How robbed I am. Well, let's go in the Light Palace, the Hailstone Shelter. Oh, that Goomba's dead. Oh, hey, look, it's this thing. Oh, yes, yes, please give me that. This game really loves its Wario Land 4 tiles. And frankly, I can't blame it. Okay, I'm still looking out for coin, though. Ow. How dare you. For that, you will perish. You got a point. You got a point. It's funny to think that there are fan games this old at this point. Like, this game was released, like, so long before Mario Odyssey. This, this is a pre-Odyssey world. It might even be a pre-Galaxy world, I don't remember. When did Galaxy come out? Okay, this is the end of the level. Oh crap, crap. That, that is a one-up, which is cool, but also not what I need. Galaxy was 2007. Yeah, I remember when Galaxy was about to come out. This one guy, I think it was Toodle's team. There's a Koopa there. Where did, where did you come? Oh, he's vibrating. Oh, 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 oh. Anyway, I think to Toodle's team released like Mario Galaxy Pinball and I don't know why like that's one of the fan games that stuck with me but I don't know it's just it was Mario Galaxy Pinball before Galaxy had even come out yeah it's like when this game when this game came out oh my god when this game came out Super Mario Sunshine was the most recent 3D Mario like, that's wild to think about. Ah, yes, Paper Bowser World. Honestly, after I've streamed Thousand Year Door proper, I, I may actually stream those. But I felt like, you know, it doesn't make a lot of sense to stream that game without having streamed the game it's based on. I... Really should have gotten that one up up there. A whole Paper Bowser game? I always wanted that. Well, good news. Go to MFGG. MFGG.net. Look up Paper Bowser World. And then you got three games in that style. The first one's based mostly on Thousand Year Door. And then you got, like, the sequel. Project Gr Grom. Which is, is kind of more based on Super Paper Mario. But the, you know, the idea gets across. Oh, no, 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 no. I think I'm almost good on lives. I just want a few more. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh yeah, because he talked to God once. Yeah, I remember that story, like... Yeah, that was, that was... 
something. I don't know. I mean, I had my doubts that, you know, God had wanted him to get out of fan games. But, you know, it's, it's his life to live. He can do whatever he wants, I suppose. Anyway, we're in the ice cave. Here's Spike. He's dead. It's also funny in regards to these old fan games where, like... You know, we had we had really slow internet, so they all have like midis for music. And now it's nowadays it's just like, yeah, just shove just shove 300 OGG files in there, OGG files. Just uh, who cares? Do it. It is also the chip tune of Doom. Chip Doom. Uh, oh, that is just really poor timing right there. Okay, I'd rather not... I'd rather not lose my fireball. Oh, I love the pause to reload the midi. I'm up. Did you know that? Did you know that I was up? You had fiber internet in 2003? Ow. How do you do these? How do you do these magical things? How do I get out of here? <laughs> oh, over here. But yeah. I had many a good time downloading midis. Downloading cool midis. Oh hey Hypernova, haven't seen haven't seen you in one of these in a while. Oh, ooh. oh Yoshi. Thank you. One of the first places in the US to have it. But that that is really cool though. But no, me, me, I had dial up, <laughs> and it was really, really, really slow dial up too. So like, the thing is, I couldn't even really download these fan games. Oh no, I didn't want to go in there. I couldn't even really download these fan. No, I chose the wrong thing. I didn't even really download these fan games at my house because even. Even with the super tiny file size, it would take ages to download. So what I would do, and I, I think I've told this story before, but I'll tell it again. I went, like my one year my uncle gave me a flash drive, and this is the first time, that was the first time I had ever seen one of those. You know, flash storage was a new concept to me. Like I was, I was still getting the ropes. When it comes to computers, I was still learning. I mean, we're all still learning, because there's like a million things to learn. But... Anyway. So, he had to explain to me... He had to explain to me, like, what you did with it. So I fiddled around for a bit, and then I, you know, I discovered... Oh, wow, you can put files on this. And at first, you know, I didn't really see the point. I was like, okay. You can put files on this, so what? What, what, what is that good for? I already have a hard drive. But then, I realized that you can just plug it into any computer. You know, no matter what. So see, what I would do is I'd take my flash drive with me places, and whenever I went to like a relative's house who had faster internet, or like the public library, that was a common one, I would download fan games off of like MFGG. And then I would put them on the flash drive so I could play them back home. And I, I feel like I, you know, I felt like I had 300,000 IQ for that one. So yeah, I got a lot of mileage out of that. <laughs> uh, 
and that's that's how I got a lot of my fan game playing done. Tustin invented file transfer. Before that, people just used smoke signals to send fan games. I may have copied some floppies back in the day. Oh, but you wouldn't, though. Floppy and zip drives, yeah. I, I think... Oh, no. Okay, I'm fine. I think floppy and zip drives were a little before my time. Just, just slightly. Like, I think... Like, I was born just in time for Universal Serial Bus to take the world by storm. Like, I had... I had a couple, like, Windows 95, 98 computers. I didn't use them too much. I, I didn't really get using computers all that much until X Windows XP was a thing. And I played many a Space Cadet. Ooh, this is a pretty level. Parabeetles Parada- oh no. I don't- I don't like what this imply- oh. Oh, he's my friend. Oh. How do I go down? Oh, he just automatically switches? He just automatically switches. Okay, cool. Oh, 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 I can jump to get him to change. And yeah, it's just, it's just wild to think about how far these things have come, because now... Now it's like 100 megabytes is basically nothing. Like, I- I wipe my butt with 100 megabytes. <laughs> I'm kinda curious if modern smartphones can read floppy via USB. On Android, I'm sure there's a way. On iOS, I don't know. But on Android, almost certainly. There- there's gotta be something you can do. Because Google's just like, yeah, sure, do whatever you want. We don't care. You can't do dick on iOS without jailbreaking it, so I doubt it. Yeah. And I'm trying- how do I- I need to separate. I need to separate myself from the beetle. But yeah, I've- I've looked into jailbreaking, like, my iOS devices I have right now, but they do- they make it kind of difficult. Oh, hey, Jazio. Man, I'm glad I decided to stream anyway, because, you know, this is- this is a pretty good turnout so far. You know, I- like, I usually try to gauge interest in my stream Discord before I stream, because I- you know, I don't want to stream to just nobody, but... But, you know, sometimes you can't use that to judge, really. And the collision detection leaves a little to be desired here. It's alright, though. You know, if I- if I were to clip out of bounds right now, that would just be okay. There's a blooper over there. No. Please, please don't. Please stop. This, this cease. Look, it was the only big blooper sprite we had. It was the only one they were. They had just sold out. This was the only one left. But yeah. Back in 2003, four people made custom sprites and you just had to accept whatever they made. Yeah, you got... You know, we had four channels and you just had to accept whatever was on. You don't want to watch Hogan's Heroes? Too bad. I hope this isn't the goal. This is probably the goal. Oh wait, am I, am I racing this dude? I feel like I'm racing this dude. 
Oh, I was. See, that's the game designer brain. Almost poked myself in the eye. That's the game designer brain working right there. It's like, why would there be a beetle, Buster Beetle, down there where he can't do anything to me? Either he's gonna throw stuff at me or it's a race. I feel like I'm going to sneeze at any moment. Hang on, let me, let me, uh, blow my nose real quick. Uh, sicky, sicky, sicky. Oh, a piece of ice almost came out of my mouth while I was saying that. <laughs> I got no coordination today. Okay, go. Go, my friend. Oh, we're going backwards. We are going backwards now. Are there any rocky wrenches? Any rocky wrenches here? Oh, no! Anything over here? No, 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 no. There is not. You know, this- this midi is trying its best. Oh, Rocky Wrench! Rocky Wrench! Uh, throw the wrench on him! That is the best Stallone I'm willing to do. Okay, purposefully ignore pipe. Maybe I shouldn't have, I don't know. Okay, what's what's over here though? Yep, yep, yep. Okay, that's what I thought. Oh no, don't do that to me. Oh no 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 no. Get me out of here. Oh, we're going to space. We're going to the moon. Sorry about that, Toad. I just bought NFTs. Oh, it's the Mario Land 2 song that everybody loves. Everybody loves it so much. Oh. There's no gravity. Except that's not true. There's a li there's a little bit. Yeah, apparently songs when you're on the moon. That's just what the people like. Moon music. What's up here? Besides Rocky Wrench. Oh, mini coin. I knew there was something. I knew there had to be something. I, I actually do. This, is, this midi's pretty good. I like that. Do y'all remember Mario Quest 2? That shit was insane. Yeah, yeah, I played that back in the day. Maybe I should stream that at some point. Because it really, it really is just like total ape shit. Or maybe, maybe bat shit.
it would be more appropriate. It's 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 insane. Oh, the boss stage. <laughs> Do another fan game potpourri starring me. Oh, I was. Oh no, it's the scary mask man. While we're in Arabia. Nope, nope. But yeah, I, I want to. I just, you know, I got so many things I've been meaning to do. Oh, that's not good. Don't, don't put the key. Don't put the key in the wall. Okay, where am I taking this? Okay, cool. Cool, thank you. Though, if you recall, we, we, we have some special plans for the next one. It may not quite be what one expect. Oh, X! Oh, get me out of here. Get- <laughs> Hmm. This level... Out of all the levels I have seen, this level is certainly the most levelish. Oh my god. Oh my god. Please. Mercy. No, mercy! Maybe I should come down here and like clear the area out before I grab the key. Oh crap. Actually, this did not work to my benefit. Oh crap, crap, crap. Oh, yes, good. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Were there, were there others? Were there other things to activate? I don't think so, right? Oh, you probably gotta, like, get the blocks and then bring the key up. Oh. What in the Sam heck? Am I looking at here? Uh... Wait, were those Wario Land 4 assets? Yes, they were. This game uses a lot of them. Uh, it, oh, come on! I need to get the green. Okay, there we go. Oh. Sorry, we had to load the midi. Oh, come on. Come, come on! I'm going in the keyhole, screw you. Oh, now I'm in Moonside. <laughs> oh, no. Please. Please, I'm only a boy. Uh, I'm just a poor boy. Can I- can I have a mushroom, baby? Can I have a mushroom, man? <laughs> can I have a checkpoint or something, please? I'm gonna die. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. There's so many roto disc. Okay, thank you. Give it, give, 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 give. Worm.
Honestly, the moon gravity is not as fun as you'd think it would be because it makes you very s it makes you very slow. Do I get points for stomping on these guys? I don't know. Because it's kind of hard to do. I already forgot what block I needed to turn off. But first I want to check to see what's up here. What's... Oh. Uh, it's probably death, so I want to turn on the yellow. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay, do that. Do that. That might be it. I don't know. Load the midi. Okay, yeah, I can I can get up now. I can get up. And you gotta get up to get down. I have not seen the coin. And that makes me afraid because I kind of don't want to play the level again. Out of all the levels in this game that I want to play again, this is not at the top of the list. Okay, that- ah, uh, come- get back here. We Anything cool? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, I found nothing! Oh, and I'm going to die. I'm going to take a risk. It did not pay off. Okay, so you do get a checkpoint in Moonside, so that's good at least. Okay, oh no wait, you come back up here once you have blue, probably. Oh, oh. So you turn off yellow. And then you go turn on blue, and then you can go back to the first area. Oh, 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 okay. I don't know what that was. Okay, how, how, how get back up? Okay, no, no, wait, wait, wait I, I know how. I know, I know how. It is- it is so simple. Just give me a moment. While I go through the void. Okay, right here. Yeah, go there. And now go here, okay. And the coin is gonna be up here, because if it's not, I'm going to have diarrhea. Okay, it is. Okay, so don't have to play that again. Don't have to run... Run from Phanto again. Oh, no. I'm sorry that my sense of humor is threatening to defecate myself if things do not go my way, but it is, and that's just what we're all gonna have to deal with here. Oh no. Oh, I, see. I avoided it. No, 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 get down! Get down! Oh. No! Uh, <laughs> oh, whatever. I don't even care anymore. Does it look like I care at this point? <laughs> oh, no! My controller! Table is very loose. Jennifer said you sounded like Jorgen Von Strangle when you were scrambling for the one-up. But I like to scramble the fairies! Oh, it's Frog.
And he's going to become the Great Wart. Ha ha ha! Fungus, whatever am I going, gonna do with you? I was saving this guy for last, but it turns out I've miscounted the number of worlds. Anyway, prepare to meet your worst nightmare. <laughs> Yeah, see? The Great Ward ha ha ha. Wait, why is it a remix of Peach's Castle? W Wart, Wart never goes to Peach's Castle. I play Mario too, I know how this works. Oh, oh god, this guy- oh! Okay, I didn't need the items anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here come that boy. Oh. Oh, God, the, the radius on that is so unforgiving. Oh, like... Oh, no, no. Also, he can knock you off your cloud, just, just so you know. Hey, you! Get off of my cloud! Uh, hold on. Hold on. What do you want? I'm in my room streaming. Yes. <laughs> okay. Bye bye. Oh. <laughs> Got called by Wart. Eh, she's a little bit like Wart sometimes. I don't want my mouse cursor in front of the window. Why is that there? Okay, let's try that again. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, give me that, give me that, give me that. Okay, I, did, I didn't get him. Ah, no, that was my veggie. I needed that. For killing you. I mean, I understand why you would not want that to happen. No! Okay, let's lead him. Let's lure him to the top. Oh, he, he shot him out backwards. That's not supposed to happen. Oh, no! Stop! How did I do this when I was five years old? Again, don't know why it's Peach's theme. There we go. He really- he don't like vegetable. Oh, no, no, no! I want to defeat the evil frogman and save the ninth dimension. Yeah, 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 Kamek has stuff to say. Yo, I'm Kemek, and I'm here to say... Uh, uh, uh... No, 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 give me down, give me down from here. Oh, there's evil veggies now. You don't want to get the evil veggie. <laughs> Watch me scare Fred right under his balls.
Oh, dead. Yes, thank you. Okay, so one world left. I think we can finish this this time. Which is good because I wanted I wanted to get this done before October because I have many sp I have many spooky things that I would like to do. Oh wait, wait no, we got we got one more level here. Never mind. Toad versus Toad, who will win? Okay, blue skies. Mr. Blue Sky. Oh. Oh, it's very wet up here. <laughs> no, I'm gonna ignore that. <laughs> okay. You know what? I'll bite. Just gonna slide. Just gonna- just gonna slide around a little bit. It's okay. I guess you mostly just wanna, you know, get a big- big old score. Oh dear, oh. Oh, ow. Oh no, give me that. I want it. I want that. It's nothing too, nothing too fa- No! <laughs> you know, they give you some lives. Give you a couple lives. What? I want that. Is the audio glitching for anyone else? Like, glitching how? Okay, now for the speed run. The game audio is choppy. That's weird. Is it still doing it? Yes. Let me try restarting. It's weird. It's just fine for me. Tell me if it, tell me if it's doing it now. Okay, so um, I don't know what that was. Maybe there was some kind of weird memory leak or something. Uh, just let me know if it happens again. Okay. Okay. You know, they... Koopa Core. They included the expansion pack to prevent that. Okay, the castle. Hey, this Koopa Castle Museum is closed till we do something about that freeloader Kemek. Fine, explore the place if you want, but if, don't go suing us if you are murdered, you hear? Uh, Mario wouldn't say murdered, they wouldn't say that. You? Trying to stop Kemek? Oh, no, 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 no. Don't even try it. I don't want to be the one to clean up whatever's left of you off the floor, no sir. Uh, these shrooms are so gaudy, and out of place, too. I swear they weren't here before. Whoever put them here has no respect for this castle's historical significance. Oh, the sub, Bowser sub. Oh, we... Leave me alone. 
Yes, I've plugged the hole with a donut. Laugh if you must. Uh, but I can't make it... I can't make it go down. <laughs> Maybe later. The spook shack. Oh, it's a spook how- oh. Oh, ow. Stop! Oh, uh, I'm- I'm not doing good in the spook house. Uh, oop. Where's this chandelier from? Oh, uh, Luigi's Mansion! Except, in this timeline, Luigi did not happen. So it's just a mansion. They look like they're from a GBA Castlevania. Yeah, maybe. No. 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 Okay, it's probably- oh. Well, I didn't get the coin that I was looking for, but that is pretty good. The blocks are transparent. They're also exploding. Uh, I don't know. Not- not actually as frightening as my animation would lead you to b- Ow. Would lead you to believe. The chandelier on the other end, yeah. Okay, dash! Oh no, ow. Oh, it's dark. It's dark. So what type of block could this be? It could be anything. At any point. Dark level giving me crappy Mario Maker level vibes. Oh, coin. Coin. Located. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm not usually a fan of dark levels, because that's, that's kind of my pet peeve trope. Is... Oh man, you, you can't see. But, you know, silhouette levels on the other hand, I'm- I'm cool with silhouette levels. House of the Angry Sun. You better run, you better take cover. I thought I could kill him with a vegetable, but this seemed not to be the case. Turns out... Vegetable does not kill the sun. Oh, but he will- he will burn these. Oh! <laughs> cool, thanks. I appreciate it. Is that like Cacoletta slowed down? Oh, hey, Callum. Nice to see you around. We're just being attacked by the sun. Just like real life. Ow. Oh, no. Oh, oh, oh no! It's the bug! No, I fixed it! I fixed it! Oh, 
Let me see. How do I, uh... How do I check the DPU affinity? I'm trying to- I'm trying to find out. I forget where I go in Task Manager to see this. How do- how do I find this? Your Windows 10, right? Yeah. Go to- go to details. Maybe that. Oh yeah, I found it. I found it. Oh, okay, here's the problem. It- it turned it back on, somehow. Turned it back on, somehow. Uh, okay, it resets every time, apparently. So, I just got really lucky that it didn't happen last time. I thought it- I thought it saved. I thought it saved, like, which I'm running it on. Okay. But I should have fixed it now. Yeah, these old... For anyone unaware... You know, because we got some different people here this time. For anyone unaware, these old, like, games made in old Click Team products... Like... They, they have this glitch where sometimes the game will just... Like, get stalled on some kind of sound. And... You know, the game will lag, like it'll freeze up every few seconds and the sound will just keep playing over and over and over. And it basically makes the game unplayable, but... Somebody figured out... That if you set it to only run on one CPU core... Then you should be alright. Which I- which I did last time. But it does- it didn't save. I thought it saved. It did not. So, there you go. It's a- it's a challenge with a lot of old fan games. Both Mario and Sonic. Because, you know, they- a lot of them were made in Multimedia Fusion. And, you know, back before that even, like, Games Factory. Okay, but we're- we're back where we were, roughly. But I must use the sun to my advantage now. Perhaps just run them on a Windows 98 VM. I do have an XP VM set up, but I... I thought we'd be okay without. This is a suspicious pipe. Oh. I'll see if there's a way to force single core each time. Well, with any luck, this will be the last stream of this, but it would be useful for any future old fan game streams. Ow. Oh, this is the end of the level. It'd be cool if there was, like, some kind of Play Night plugin for that. Cause see, I, I use Play Night as my games launcher. As of maybe this year. And there's- there's one plugin that lets you, like, choose whether or not you want to automatically start Special K with it. The, the program, not the serial. Watch me scare Fred out of his balls. Uh, but... It'd be cool if there was something like that, but for stuff like CPU Affinity like, automatically have Play Night do it for you. That would be cool. I mean, if any plug-in developers ever watch this, there, here, there's an idea for you. The chances of that are relatively slim where I am right now, but... I mean, it's possible, I suppose. Oh. Uh. Okay, don't go in the pipe. Don't go in the funky pipe. 
because that is the end of the level. Oh, ow, ow. Okay, don't go in any of these. Okay, I know what I must do now. I sent you something on Discord for later that should help. Oh, well, thank you, Kovar. You know, Kovar here, he's, he's a bit of a tinkerer. And he's helped me out with a few things, so shout out to Kovar. Like, he was helping me figure out why uh, the, <laughs> the encoding overloads were happening during Crash 4 last time. And while I came up with the solution, I believe, I still appreciate being helped anyway. <laughs> you know, it, it's the thought that- it's the thought that counts. And it's the count that thoughts. But he has helped me with things. Like, he has actually found the solution for things before. I don't want it to seem- I don't want this to seem backhanded now. Oh, uh, I'm going- I'm going to die. I mean, truth be told, a lot of my process is just try things until something works. I don't know. I mean, would you think that... Oh, well, I know where the coin is. I mean, would any of you think that, like, my color monitor <laughs> plug-in would be the cause of encoding overloads? Because when I started that whole process, I sure wouldn't have. <laughs> but that seems to be what it was. So basically what I'm saying is I am going to never install any OBS plugins ever again. <laughs> what I have now is what I will use. I'm not I'm not introducing anything else. Because apparently apparently your stream can just die. <laughs> like I install a plugin that makes a little dancing man appear on my screen. And then all of a sudden, I am rendering no frames. Oh no, wait, it wasn't my color monitor, I don't think. It was my waveform generator. That's right, I, I had it mixed up. Like, uh, you know how I have the little music waveform from FUBAR when I have the BRB screen? You know that? What am I doing here? I forgot what I was saying. <laughs> I lost my train of thought. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. The, but the, yeah, the little FUBAR BRB, th like, waveform thing. I was going to have that as a plugin. Somebody made a plugin for that. How do I get through here? But yeah, I was going to use a plug-in for that. Oh, now this pipe works, and I die going into the pipe. Amazing. Um, but I was going to try a plug-in for that, so I could make it look nice and neat, you know, make it look clean. But unfortunately, that just enco that causes encoding overloads, apparently. I have no idea why. I mean, yeah, as Kovar said one time, it might not be an actual encoding overload, but still, why... Why is this stopping me from rendering frames? Like, like, waveform, you're not even on screen right now. Why do you do this? Why you do this to me? I think we can all agree that technology is stupid. But it's also so good. Which is why I continue to use it. Because, I mean, I am playing a, f a fan game from 2006, and you guys are hundreds of miles away watching me right now. If that ain't magic, I don't know what is. It's like, you know, some people are gonna be like, oh, Harry Potter's not real. I can't do Wingardium Leviosa. Son, I am streaming 
I'm streaming video to people in like Nevada right now. Magic is real. I am going to die. No, I'm not. I don't think a single one of your current viewers are from Nevada. Uh, that's fine. Oh, <laughs> Torpedo Ted is here. Please stop shooting at me. I, I, I wish to leave. So, a qu question. Babom Battlefield. Am I alone in thinking that it doesn't feel much like a battlefield? I mean, I know it's supposed to be the first level, and it's supposed to have a sort of welcoming atmosphere. But I don't know, it's like, it doesn't really feel like much of a battlefield. Like, the closest thing we get is, like, the fact that bombs are there. You know, they're sentient bombs. And then there's water balloons. <laughs> Dustin. Dustin wants the pink mabombs to say war. <laughs> war never changes. None of this is good, Mario. That's why it's called war. <laughs> why are the Shy Guys grayscale? Why are we doing this? Are they frozen? Are they- do they have frostbite? Do you need medical attention? What are we fighting for? Yeah, it's been a while since I, like, looked at Super Mario 64, really good edition. I just remember there was a shoop de whoop in it, and I made- I made fun of him for having a shoop de whoop <laughs> in the year of our Lord, I don't know, probably 2016. Wario's Battle Canyon. Yeah, Wario's Battle Canyon feels like a battle fi- oh. Can I kill these guys? I think- I think they're grayscale because they- no, they're not invincible. Yeah, Wario's Battle Can- <laughs> Zawarudo! Tokyo Tamari! Grayscale is- Grayscale is statues. Oh, okay. Toad. What if the game guy p theme played whenever you entered a room? Would you like that or would you probably end, end your own life? And no, there's no way to turn it off. Kind of just, it's kind of just too many cooks, isn't it? <laughs> you know, the scene with the doctor. <laughs> oh god, too many cooks is like modern art. Like, freaking... Somebody said, like, okay, it's one thing to see something like that bizarre on TV. But you gotta keep in mind that this aired probably at, like, four in the morning. And whoever was viewing it probably was, like, I don't know, you're, like, either really sleepy or you're high on weed or something. And you're just like... <laughs> You're just like on the couch, barely awake, and that comes on TV. <sighs> yeah, Adult Swim has a lot of very strange, very strange content. Oh! 
Oh, no, no. <laughs> oh. I wish, uh, I kind of wish I had HBO Max right now, because I want to watch Aqua Teen Hunger Force. No, that's, that's the end of the thought. Yes. Yes, die. I gotta- I gotta finish watching King of the Hill, though. That- that show's kinda long, I don't know if you know that. Oh, okay, okay. I see what must be done. King of the Hill is indeed a very good show. Except whenever Peggy Hill is on screen. You know, at first, I swear, you hear about Peggy Hill, and you're like, you start watching the show, and you're like, oh, well, okay, she's not that bad, you know, she's not, she's not that bad of a character. And then, <laughs> and then, the further you get in the show, you're like, oh, uh, King of the Hill isn't Adult Swim original content, and you can tell. Yeah, King of the Hill is a very laid-back kind of show. Like, if most of what Adult Swim puts out... ...is, uh, you know, crazy acid trip fever dreams... ...King of the Hill is very much not that. King of the Hill... ...is- is kind of more like... ...you know, the humor is in its mundanity. M mundanity How do you say that? Streaming is making me say a lot of words that I'm realizing I have never said out loud before. But either way, it's- it's very mundane, but that's- that's the humor. You know? <laughs> it's like the Hill family is honestly very- they are very boring people. But that- that's where the comedy comes from. It's like- Oh, Bobby, we're gonna go on a father-son bonding trip with a lot of, you know, get us some adrenaline. And then it's just like, they're fishing in a lake. And then Hank's like, I, I know, Bobby, I know that this is very extreme, but you gotta, you gotta, you know, take a deep breath, son. They're, yeah, they're boring people except for Dale. Oh my god, I just realized something. Sticks the Badger in Sonic Boom is basically what if Dale was a female Sonic character? That's her entire thing. That seems like a weird thing to just say, but. <laughs> I wonder if she'll ever show up in another Sonic thing. Because Boom is kinda. Boom is kinda dead in the water. Okay, I'm building the bridge. Okay, the bridge has been constructed. I don't like the space levels because they take away my ability to run. And, you know, I enjoy running. You know, much like Snonic the Hog Hog. My hero and idol. Okay, I- I don't think I collected the coin at any point. The big coin. The metal. <laughs> and I'm allowed to go back down, so I probably will. I mean, it's really no different from just playing the level a second time. Hedgehog- Hedgehog cute. Yeah. Where is this? Uh. Honestly, Sonic does not prepare you for how freaking adorable those things are in real life. Oh, I'm dead.
Okay, where is the medal? We gotta find... We gotta find the stuff. I mean, I haven't gotten any encoding overload, so that's probably a good sign, but I'm also... You know, maybe a more intensive game would be a better judge. Oh... Okay, it's not over here. Is it over here? Oh... Oh, I don't see, I don't see it. Oh, wait, 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 coins. Oh, no, wait, that's just the way up, right? I don't know. I don't know, I'm lost. I need an adult. Okay. But you are an adult. Oh. Dang it, I have to take responsibility for my own situation. I, I may be one, but don't act it, lol. Yeah, kind of same. But honestly, you only have to be so adult, really. Like, every everybody's always like, oh, you know, you gotta... Oh, you gotta, like, be all boring and stuff. You gotta- you can't play video game no more. Who's gonna stop me? Okay, I'm down below. I am in the underground. The undergrowth. Oh, right, right, I was here before. Where- where is the coin? Can I please have the coin? And this is where you build the bridge. Where- where is this thing? Do I have to kill every Goomba? Probably not. Very saucy. I feel like it's gotta be around the end somewhere. Like right around here. I, I feel like I gotta get on top of this thing. Mm, pardon me. I don't know how I do that. But I feel like that's what you gotta do. That's just the vibe I get. That's the game designer brain. Oh, oh. You see this? Slightly miscolored block. You know, every time I think the game is done with its silly tricks, and then it hits me with slightly miscolored block. Okie doke. So that's done. Koopa Core. Scumbug. I love 2D platformers with a shit ton of secrets. Me too. Oh no. The gimmick is that swim is inverted. D Donkey Kong Country 3 moment. Fireballs is also inverted, yes. Everything is invert. Okay, check over here. Nope, nothing. I mean, this is a- this is a creative gimmick. 
really makes you it really makes you think, don't it? Think about upside down. Uh. Uh. Oh, oh, oh. No, don't loot the midi. Don't do that right now. I'm not ready. Ow. I touched Electro. The X blocks are from Metroid Fusion, aren't they? Uh, you mean like these? Or did I? Oh, no, those right there. No, I think those are Wario Land still. But as you know, Wario Land and Metroid Fusion are exactly the same game. Oh no, oh no. Bitrate. I thought we had that sorted out. Let's hope that doesn't happen again, because otherwise I may have to call Internet Man back. He must come back into the fray. <laughs> the freaking ice noise. <laughs> like, it sounds like it's screaming. You remember how in Mario 1, uh, the toads were apparently turned into blocks? Yeah, that, that happened in this game, but only with the ice. I don't know what they were thinking with that plot point. I mean, I understand the manual says like, oh no, no, it's all right. That, that when Mario breaks the bricks, he, he saves them, he saves them. But... <laughs> You know, most people are gonna think like, oh, oh god, no. Oh, which one do I want to go in, though? Oh no! Let me go back! Put me back in! Put me back in! Ugh. Needless to say, I don't think that's canon anymore. To whatever extent anything in Mario is canon. Okay, let me just... Let's see how fast I can get through this level. Probably not very. Moving at the speed of slow Got nowhere else to go Oh, you're a regular- you're a regular funny man, aren't you? Oh god, my- my eye itches But I can't pause I mean, my eyebrow, not my eye. Uh, no, 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 no. I need more lives, please. Please, I'm gonna get a game over. And probably die. And go to hell before I die. No, please. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no. Oh, no. Stop looping the MIDI, please. We don't need to loop the MIDI. Just keep it. Just, just, just keep it dead silent forever. No, 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 no. I can't shoot down. I need you to remember that. Can't do it. Okay, so I chose badly last time. Oh, but here's the correct option. Here I go. Here I go. 
<laughs> the giant clam is coming. Oh no! One, two, in the minor key. Every plumber knows this. That means death. I I can't talk tonight. I'm sorry. I'm gonna blame it on the cold. I got a head cold. Yes, I have the power of God. <laughs> what is that background in the last room of that level? I think it was another thing from Wario Land Four. This game loves Wario Land 4. <laughs> now this game is canon. Yes. They saved the best for last. Okay, I know what I gotta do. Oh, I can aim down. And up. And make you guys a little nauseous, probably. No! Thunder Dragon in 2006. Oh, look, guys, look. It is Nintendo's greatest creation. Wario Land 4 on the Game Boy Advance. Oh, no. Uh, oh, but I gotta try. I gotta try again. I got one life. One life to live. Can I destroy this? Yes, I can. I can destroy all of Koopa's arsenal. Or I guess it's Kamek's now. Koopa's dead. K Koopa was murdered. Mario didn't just defeat him. He, he killed him. And he killed him about as dead as you can kill someone. It's like in New Super Mario Brothers where Bowser's freaking flesh melts off and Mario just says, That's just so nice. <laughs> I'm a light dead. Good thing that wasn't a pit of death. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> oh no. Am I, am I screwed? I'm screwed. Yep. <laughs> and I gotta get the coin again because... Da, na, 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 na. Does F2 reset? It does. Mm, golf music. Hello, Bingo Bo. How's it swinging? Okay, gotta, gotta get the coin again. But now I know I can do that. And then when Mario 3D World came out, Nintendo stole this idea, as they tend to. Like, you know that whole thing in Odyssey? Where Mario can turn into enemies? Yeah, that was my idea. I was doing that first. Unfortunately, Nintendo has a team and, like, actual work ethic, so their, their game came out first. Wouldn't it be wild if it came out that irrefutably Nintendo did steal ideas from fan games? Yeah, that would be... That would be crazy. I mean, honestly, like... I mean, I'd like to receive royalties for that, but, you know... If Nintendo just wants to, like, put me in the credits, like, patch me into the credits of Odyssey... That'd be good enough, I think.
Yeah, just just patch me into Odyssey's credits. Say like uh Dustin VG, he did something, I guess. And you could put that shit on your resume and get any game dev job you want. I guess that is true. Nintendo my ideas are so good that Nintendo stole them. Hire me today. Oh no. I am in a bad spot. I'm in a pickle. Oh no, I'm not. <laughs> Dustin VG for playing more Metopia than anyone else. I mean, it's true. I, I played the game twice, which is more times than anyone has ever played it before. 3DS or Switch? Both. Both, actually. Now, I like. How much does the minigame cost? Five thousand. Oh, it's the it's the boss from World One. <laughs> At least I think that was World One. But I do not have enough points, so we're going in raw. The Koopa Curse. Oh, what a horrible night to have a curse. Oh, this this midi. I love this midi. What is this? Sounds like a, an arrangement of Super Mario World Castle. Yeah, that is exactly what it is. Except this feels like freaking... What, what if it was in... I don't know, a Sonic or Mega Man game or something. Or maybe Castlevania, even. Sounds more like a remix of the airship theme in Mario Maker. Well, no, because this game predates Mario Maker by a number of years. Quite a few, probably at least ten. But I can't get more specific than that because I have no grasp of time. Nine years? Ah, oh, so close! Yeah, nine years older than Mario Maker. I don't like this. I don't like this arrangement. I mean, not the musical arrangement. I've established I like that. Ah! Now that is just kind of a, a, a wiener thing to do. I won't lie to you. Oh no, I needed to kill the boo. And now he will haunt me for the rest of my days. Can I kill him with explosion? Remember when Mega Man 1 had a level editor? Yep, Powered Up is a very good game. Oh, how do I- how do I get this? I want it- no! No, I'm not- I'm not beating this level without the coin. I am not beating this level without the coin because this- this level will take forever to play again. So I'm gonna go back to World 1 and get a hammer. Okay, what? Oh, I didn't even read the rules. <laughs> Game audio's weird again. Well, it's, it's probably just as well. Because... Let's see, what is, what is this thing Kovar sent me? It will permanently modify an EXE to force usage of a single core. Interesting. You know what? I'm gonna try it. Now, what do you do with this? Okay, so... So 
just this, and then... I'm gonna make a copy of the EXE, just to be safe. You never know what, what's gonna go on with these things. So then, point it to the EXE. Okay, let's let's see if that works. No, I I didn't mean to do that. Okay, here we go. I mean, it still seems to run just fine, at least. I mean, I, I don't know if we're gonna find out if this totally fixes it, considering that last time I didn't have, <laughs> I didn't have it set right and it never happened, so... <laughs> but if nothing else, we know that the game apparently still works. So I need a hammer, so I can hammer in the morning. Hammer in the evening, hammer at supper time. No, do not retry the stage. Because, like I said, I want the coin. To- to leave that level without getting the coin is just a waste of my time. It's a waste of everyone's time, really. Oh, I get, like, two points from doing that. You know this is a fan-made Mario game, because... No Mario game, no official Mario game would ever give you single-digit score. Not as big a time waster as Sonic 1 GBA. Well, you know, at least that's funny. It gives me the big haha. -ha. God, does, is this MIDI, like, made for this game? Or can, is this, can this be found somewhere, I wonder? Because I would love to hear this with, like, you know, not Windows MIDI instruments. That would be, that would be cool. Somebody should remake New Super Mario Bros. DS in Super Mario World. Somebody did try. Like, I remember seeing a hack that tried to do that. Windows puts them in a temp location when it plays them. Interesting, do you happen to know where that is? Because yeah, I would... I would like to have this. Either way, here's the coin. Okay, we're good. Can I scroll this guy off screen? Yes, but it didn't help. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. Okay, boss time. Final boss. Thanks to you, I'm all out of decent henchmen, so I am now forced to use a Goomba to guard the last star sphere. A Goomba, for Pete's sake! And do your thing, useless. Oh, it's Satan, Goomba. Oh. Oh, crap. He creates fire now.
I think I'm not supposed to get hit this mi Well, I'm not supposed to die, but... I mean, I'm pretty sure there's something after this. Like, I, I feel like after this you fight Kemic proper, and I don't remember if there's checkpoints or what, I don't know. <laughs> Pardon me. Oh, crap. Coconut Mall? I don't think Coconut Mall had a boss. Oh, uh, yep. It breaks. <laughs> Foolish little fungus. Did you really think I would entrust the actual star sphere to such an incompetent underling? I, Kemek, have the real thing. Come if you dare. Oh, and now we're going back. We're gonna do it, but this time in reverse. Uh oh, Koopa Troll. Come on, come on. Ah, oh, crap. That's not good for me. That is not good for me. I need- I need to go. I'm sorry, I was waiting for the thwomp, but it just wasn't working. Oh, that's- that's a butt clincher right there. Oh! Thank you. Thank you. Okay, what? Oh no! Oh no, he's- he's large and he is in charge. Thank you for that. Thank you for, for three up. I needed that. <laughs> Fungus alive? Why you? No matter. I won't. Oh, my bad. Banjo Kazooie laugh. Ah, uh, Mario RPG. What a quality title. Ah, uh, cr- no! Nope, I gotta- I gotta already be holding him. Oh, no! Pretty cool final boss, though. <laughs> oh, no, I- I meant to read that. <laughs> I like- I really like the idea of, like, turning around to get him to teleport to the other side and hit himself with his own <laughs> weapon. Oh, there we go. One hit. Oh. Oh. They gotta, like... Nope, nope, nope.
It's hard. It's hard to throw that without getting hit. Maybe I, maybe I'm just not trying hard enough. I don't know. Hang on, hang on. Oh, there we go. One last hit. Oh, he's trying. He's trying. Oh, I love. I love when final <laughs> bosses do that. When they have that like one desperation move. So, unfortunately, we don't get to read his dialogue. Because <laughs> I'm just too based. Yeah, I did it. It was me. You said- you all said I couldn't do it. But I did. And I gave that guy the hiccups. And I have a girlfriend now, apparently. <laughs> I like that. And that guy's just like, yeah. Cool, man. Cool. And so is he. He's like, yeah. <laughs> I, I agree with what the other guy said. This really has been a Toad Strikes Back. And then he striked back all over those guys. And she's not even paying attention. But he is. And he's pissed. But we're not quite done. Because, as you know, there's the secret levels. When you get all the coins. And the final world is no exception. If I recall right, you have to have every single coin in the game. And you have to have beaten all the secret levels to get this one. So this is like the ultimate final challenge. And yep, secret stage is open. So you go over here. First, let's play the minigame. Get some extra lives, just to be safe. How many hits can you score before you hit? Oh, so you don't have to bounce on his head or anything. to give this an honest go. Oh, no. Ooh! It grazed me. Okay, I got one life from that. That's probably enough. So... Oh, no, it's right here. It's right here. Showdown on the bridge. Ominous. 
kind of creepypasta-esque. The Mario 3 lasers. You know, why Why hasn't Bowser brought these back? Uh, you know, that's, that's funny. This fire almost looks like... Could this be? I forget what I do here. Oh, wait, you gotta attack behind him. But the axe is gone now. So I think I gotta be Yoshi now. Oh, uh, crap! Yep. Okay, so... Shell removed. Jump! And fireball. Oh, he's getting mad. He is not happy. I mean, I wouldn't be either. I come back from the dead, and <laughs> this dude's flaming my tail. Oh, thank you for the heal, though. Aw, oh, crap. There's mega spikes now. going pretty well, I like to think. Oh no, he's got uh, the, the holographic kind. I don't know what to call that. Oh crap. Crap, 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 crap. Oh no, this isn't going so good no more. Oh, okay. Thank you, game. For your generosity. Genero City. God, he's fast. He is fast. He is so fast. But he is dead once more. And we should never talk about that again. And I think that's it. Let me see. Can you, uh... I don't think you can go down here. I don't think you can unlodge the donut, so I think that's it. Anyway, thanks everybody for tuning in. That has been Toad Strikes Back. Very good classic fan game. Ultimate classic fan game. Uh, so, next on the playlist, next on the agenda, if I end up streaming before October, I'll probably just throw in, like, maybe a Mario Galaxy or Sonic Adventure 2 or Animal Crossing, something or other, but I'm not going to start any major games because I'm going to do some spooky things, like I said. I want to dedicate October to the spooky. And then, you know, November, once November comes around, I'll probably be streaming Sonic Frontiers. And uh, that's that's about the playbook right now. You know, there's other possibilities, but we'll we'll see what happens. Anyway, thanks everybody. I'll see you around.